excellent total on a slow surface here at the Wanderers, one with a bit of grip and turn as Baba Azan in today was superb. Here's Hendricks, and here's the start. Slices away over the top of Slip, and that's gone for four. So a boundary is top proceedings for Pakistan. Well, carries on. Miller was 46 in 14 deliveries to finish the first innings. Ball one with Thofford. Flayed over first slip. It's going to be interesting to see if South Africa learn from Pakistan's mistakes. Do they change pace more, use more of the gripper options? Pace is going to be key on the surface. That's disappeared. So there's a couple of boundaries to start proceedings and to liven up this crowd again. Well, not a good start from Bjorn Hendricks. You know, open the bowling in the T20. These are the places you do not want to bowl. Wide, allowing batsmen to free the arms. He's now a man under pressure early on. Eight off the first two deliveries of the innings. And again, this time through, extra cover. Wow, this is exquisite stuff from Bamar Azam. Three from three. It's raining boundaries here at the Wanderers. Bull ring is buzzing. Look at it. Screaming and dancing in the stands, the Pakistan fans. And why not Baba Azam? Boy, he's been good on this tour. Loved watching him play. Forcing a change in the field after that shot. There's a sweeper now. So dip back at square leg. Bottom end, chopped into the ground. No run. Down the ground, found the gap. It's nicely stopped. It's nicely bowled. But there is no one down there, and it's gone for four. A bit of uh, bad luck there, I think, for Morris. Not sure that's the right field placing. I think that was the field they went to of Beer and Hendricks because he was traveling square of the wicket. Morris, different style bowler. Almost carried that hangover from over one into this. I wouldn't mind seeing third man back, points up, square leg back. Just too easy, that half a bat, and it's four. Well, that's wrecked around the corner for four. Easily picked up that time for Barbara Azam. He's raced to 21 off just eight deliveries. Well, these KFC kids on the boundary need to be careful because it's hitting their pace. Can't catch our breath here, Hayes. I'm OK, I'm fit. <laughs> I've seen you spent a lot of time in the KFC bucket today, Hayes. <laughs> and so far. Straight. Beats the first one. Past the second one as well, and that's gone for four. That's threading the needle, that is. Well, David Miller's first hunting in South African cap. His head must be spinning because his two frontline seamers are travelling. 14 off the first. And now Morris has gone 14 himself with one ball to go. Davies' head must be spinning. What is he thinking? Where does he go? I hope he's not looking at a comparative score anywhere because at this stage, South Africa are four for none. That's beautifully weighted. Two more the result. Strike. Quick single again. And who would have thought the debutant could... That's a really good tie at his first. There's a dot ball. Struck 
That's going to go for four. So again, first ball from over goes for a boundary. Yeah, Pablo Rosado is playing an in excellent innings. 34th now, 16 deliveries. The timing has been good. South Africa gave him momentum with some loose bowling, but now he's on a roll. It's going to be hard to keep this guy quiet tonight. He was bitterly disappointed. Had on the tour, he hasn't got enough time tonight, I don't think. But he's certainly playing beautifully. He's getting some deliveries to hit, and he's not missing any of them. Well, easy as it comes for Baba Razan. The leg stump half volley just has to help it on its way. South Africa after six with, after six overs after the power play with 44 on the board. Pakistan already 50. Pakistan at the same stage. Short and wide, hammered, and that's gone for four. Wow, what a player this guy is! I think every cricket lover has thoroughly enjoyed watching Barbara Azam play over the last couple of months. Leg stump half volley, wide long hop. Easy peasy, Baba Razab. And he's taken full toll. Three fours of 12. That's the start of this over. Just not according to plan. In fact, you'd say you're not entirely sure. Last ones. A quieter over again. Starts with the dot again. Slower again, no pace on it again. And this is why I say Makai. Bowling, bowling. Just listen to the crowd. Beautiful bowling. He's almost seen. Yeah, good change up. Rather than up there and easy. This is the time uh, doing exactly that. Singles are okay. Bowling. Yeah, good over. Just thinking two. Should be two. And it's comfortable. And it brings up a half century for Baba Razam. Such a talent for Pakistan has been so good on this tour. It's a ninth T20 international 50. And this one comes of 34 balls. Given Pakistan a wonderful start to their chase. It's on. No, it's not. Fielded. Meet. Top shot from a brilliant batsman. Picked it as a slower ball, used the feet and adjusted the shot. Still able to get it away for six. Straight as a die. And it just has to delay a little bit as he's come down the wicket. And expects a normal 
paced delivery. It's a slower one. And he is still able to get it right out the middle of the bat. Look at his head. Still down. Watches it so closely. Right onto the bat. You can see that he's grinding his teeth a bit. One fine. It's all right, just one. Razam off to the fence. Need it. Four more. Oh, it was a teaser for Van der Dessen. So within all of that, Tommy, when you're talking about, you know, give him time. Let him get used to the wicket as well. Now, every time that he comes into ball, he has to restart. You know, he can't really get into that form that I want to continue. Oh, wow. That is some shot. Such a good shot from Babarazam. It brings up the 50 partnership. And it's off just 34 balls. And he is not stopping. He is going to continue. He says that not this time. Wow. Wow. What a player. Played it very late. He almost take it from his gloves. The timing, perfect. Shamsi, he sees it and sees it. One letter, look at that. Tommy, where you can't even, you know, describe that one. You almost take it on top of middle stump. But, and deft down to third man for four. It's just brilliant batting. Just an exhibition of. Just got the feel for T20 Barbarazzi. It's dragged across. Gets here at Wanderers for the last 12 years and went to all the IPL here and all the World Cup in here. Right. I have. Well, he played through that offside. He drags it down and just picks out the fielder on the bound. Just a single. And just sticks to the basics and does them superbly. I'm thinking about two here. And it's been placed with such finesse that it's, uh, it's not even difficult. Use of the feet, another good example of just a normal cricket shot. He uses his feet to get closer to the ball to make it a fuller delivery and then just pops it into the vacant area of extra cover. Oh, this is dream stuff from a guy who's made batting look extremely easy. Artistic in style and he's been top quality in execution, almost carried for a six. He's starting to experience a little bit of cramp of Azam. Just uh, did a few stretches after he played that shot. That's been a good bit for Pakistan. Oh, that would have been out again. That's nasty. Smashed away square. Probably would have been a tide. Oh, that was almost perfect placement. Brilliant stop in the end. Bold. Yeah, good Yorker. Slower ball, gets a wicket. 
gets the big wicket of Babar Azam. South Africa come alive. Pakistan 147 for two. Barbaraza on 90. Hendricks. Exactly what we were talking about for me. Slow up. Changing of the pace. Look at that. It's something that it, they should have thought of it long time ago. Beautiful bowling. 